to where do you want it posted? Before they break, they don't post all the, all the poster for you. You know, church people are already going for this city. The word of life is there. I have not seen. I don't know of. They give it to their church members to do. But that's a business on its own. When the program finished, go there, then you remove the banner. You can use the back for anything you want to use it for. They pour a chemical on this and it wipes up. You can still use that banner. Before we Christmas, they move, they move and they use the dura back. Christmas not to do like that again. To create self, they had this day. Can't we recycle that? It can't be. There is business every year. The problem is that they are not looking at it. You they look at no eye. They say, what do you look your way face? Now your mates today they. What you going to move now? Now you what you at all? A lot of you share for you. Hello big fans of Ask Silas Diary. This is Silas Azoya and I'm in Worry. We just finished the Worry edition of um, Project CEO. And the guys here have been awesome. Uh, Shego Mane was here. Uh, in fact, a lot of guys. I'm going to be meeting them one after the other. We had fun, we shared ideas. In fact, I think we had discussion more than the three hours that we plan to have. So these are the guys. Uh, this is David. Yeah, David is smiling. David, David is an interesting guy. He has a lot of ideas. He has learned a lot uh, at Project CEO and he would like to share those ideas with us. So uh, David, what do you have to say about Project CEO? Okay, it is a, I it is very interesting and it was highly impactful and it was worth the whole time I came to worry to spend this Saturday and the road I've gone is is taking it everywhere all over the world in Jesus' name. Thank you, thank you so much. Uh, so what do you have to say for me? Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Ufuma, and Silas is a great guy. I've learned a lot just today, and I hope to learn more. Uh, so I implore you to follow him anywhere Facebook, Twitter. If you see him on the grab him. <laughs> Please, oh. This one that they are saying you should grab me. <laughs> Please be careful the way you grab me, oh. I have family. Don't kidnap me. <laughs> And uh, today has been awesome. The lessons, the, the stuff I have learned so far, they have been mind blowing. Seriously, I have to say that thank you very much for your CEO and God bless you. Are you saying this because of the camera? Or no. that's what you actually? Yes, yes, it has been mind blowing. Because nice, nice. Uh, I can't really think of what I would have been doing if not of this quality uh, information. I've okay, so, so what was your own thought? Okay, and it, it was nice. What's your name? Tell us your name. Okay, I'm Raphael. Raphael. It was nice. Um, what I, I love so much about the people, you know, the, the parts, you know, with that about you not know, seeking external validation. Yeah. You know, you know, most times you okay, take steps. Okay, it's a session. Yeah. And most times you take steps. Yeah. Uh, great steps. And then you look back, nobody is applauding you. Mm. The next you want to take. You want to retract your steps. Exactly. You know, don't seek external yeah. validation. Mm. Be, 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 be sure of what you want. Um, as long as you are sure of what you want and, 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 and you are convinced that is what I want, just move on. Okay. This other guy, this other guy I want to introduce to you is also known as Pojumantis International, John Okoti. So, John, what do you think about Project CEO? Hello guys, my name is John Okoti, the CEO of Pogematics International and it was really really nice being here because I really learned a lot of things and it was, the message was really timely because it was and I encourage everybody, every youth that is trying to come up to always participate in Project C. Thank you guys. Okay, and uh, this is not a new face on Axala's diary, we all know her, Guliana. Yeah. This is Juliana. I want to thank Silas for inviting me. 
projecting you as well, share with Mando something else. Okay. And Salas has always been silent. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. I had fun. I you know when you feel you know too much, but you know, get to learn something new. I want to thank Salas, I want to thank Shegun, I want to thank um, John Okote John Okote and my new friend that, uh, David. Hero Talk, David I want to thank everybody that came, Raphael, Dizapi and everybody It was, it was interactive and it was mindful That time it was not an overstatement or oh, understatement, it was actually mindful Thank you very much Salas for inviting me, I owe you <laughs> Okay, so that's what happened at Project CEO Worry. But I is our next stop. Emeka Nobis will be our next guest. And uh, yes, we are, we, are going to be, we are going to be turning up. Edafe brought a whole lot of guys to Project CEO today. So, Edafe, what do you think? Did this meet your expectation at all? Yeah, this is my glory because. Um, a lot of young guys out there have something inside of them, they don't know how to come out with them. But okay. a meeting like, such as this, or the CEO, mm. it has been able to bring that thing into reality. They not see that, that stuff they have inside of them can come to life. Okay. So I want to say thank you to Silas and uh, Shego Manuel for having such a wonderful uh, meeting here in Worry. And it gets me in the next six months. That's it, we never have to be the same. <laughs> In the next six months, worry will never be the same. Yes. Okay, I trust. I trust you. If it's coming from you, I trust you. Let's keep our baseline at 12,000, right? Let's keep our baseline at 2,000 every month. Ignite meetup, you called it, right? Yeah. Is it? Yeah, I think the platform should be Ignite, but now this meetup is just like a casual meetup. So it's not so We're taking action. I'm not suggesting now. We're taking action. Last Saturday of May is 27th. I will not be around. I will be having Project CEO at um, Abuja. But I want to see pictures and videos of Ignite Meetup here. Last Saturday, May. Everybody invite five people. This is action step, right? I will volunteer on behalf of Campus TV to post a blog post and if we can if we can do a video post on the channel from ignite meetup every month i think we should clap to that right so ignite meetup would officially be supported by campus tv that is what we are going to be bringing in from our perspective he didn't, he didn't know that i was going to say that i just plugged it in now 2,000 Naira every month, each person 2,000 Naira every month. We don't want to have a course where somebody is now trying to record that. Every month, we're going to take turns and talk about our expertise, our niche, like what he said. So invite five persons, you are going to be the one. I just took a head count, we are about seven of us. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That guy behind the camera can say something about videography and editing. You can you will be amazed what he will teach. I'm not joking, he works with us, so I know what he will, what he's capable of doing. Right? So we'll take turns every month you come up and speak for about 20 minutes. Take questions. I am willing to any day you decide to just let me know ahead of time. I'm fine, I'm available most of the time. I shot it between Port Harcourt and Benin City. So just let me know so that I don't travel. I travel a lot. <laughs> so you understand. Every month, there should be an Ignite Meetup. Every single month. So we'll not decide who will be hosting for that day. 
So the idea is to bring the 2,000 naira to support. So today's turn was uh, uh, promise. Ignite Meetup is owned by everybody and owned by nobody. Yes. That's the way it is. Right? Today was hosted by promise. Next month, somebody should be in front to say, this is, you don't have to wear suit and tie. You can come in short and shirt like this. better we don't wear suit and tie. In fact, suit and tie is banned. Should I remove my shirt? You understand? Don't wear, don't ever come here wearing suit and tie. You want to come here, have the kind of conversation we had today, play games, and share ideas like this. And eat cupcake with your hands, not spoon and fork. You understand? And then bite bread while we're taking pictures. We'll be like the bread next time. You you understand? So those kind of things. I like I like those kind of you know why? Business grows faster and ideas spread way faster. Then probably once in a year have the Ignite conference. By that time we would have packed up coffee shop and all neighboring houses. Oh, the thing now is oh, even even even, ministry, even, yeah. even with even with uh, our number here, yeah, we already see that we are already packed. Yeah. So by the time we come in here, we try five 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 people. It's already mm -hmm. so that's why I said the we idea, need to start. Hold on, the idea is for us to get this place so filled that if you come late, you won't get where to sit. Yeah. No, that's me. I, I, that's that's it's too small. It that's too small a vision. You understand? Hold on. Uh, sorry, sorry to cut you. I think that's why I said we should come together. You understand? I think the first step is to even look for a hotel where. Their halls are not all regularly booked. Talk to the that's management good, and good. see how we can do events there. You understand? I don't disagree with you. That's fine. That's fine. Also pack up this place first. Yes. 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 That's true. But, but the thing is, besides you going to do an event in a hotel where it's not, I'm always looking at how to bring value. Like I came here not expecting anything from the organizers, but I came here. I'm going to do something that will be of value. Either my ideas, either my services, I'm going to render for free or something. So the value you might be offering to her, it's 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 the same thing will also work if you go to a, a hotel and say you have to bring value, not come and beg them and say I beg give us this hotel for so so amount or lesser. Bring value, you have to come strong and say, see we are bringing this number of people every Saturday. You are not we want to, you are going to give us this hall for free and give us X amount of stuff for whatever rate you. So want. let them say no at their detriment. So, yes, yeah, so they they understand the picture. They see you come with a point of strength not weakness like every other person which and is then the, which is the goal we are trying to bring the strength good. and the number and people bring the person on board like sir you have you have an hotel how have you been to run this hotel come and talk about it it's value and each person is looking for a way to increase their numbers you want to increase your blog should numbers we, should we have um, just a a particular place to meet or listen ideas grow i am saying for me i'm saying pack this place out and then we decide where to go next until I, then I support that but until I think, then i think I, I think it's a good it's a good starting point you understand but, yes, yes. but but uh, i also think in as much as we are planning to, to pack this place here we should also look at getting a very good place you see the difference between the lagos people and us here is because they hide things a lot you know, and when they, they hype things, and bro, bro, besides bro, the hype, bro, bro. besides the hype, they, they do things. Sorry to cut you. You see these pictures and videos we've taken today. Mm -hmm. If we, three of us here, if we work on them, even you, we doubt that, that you, are you were in this event. I am not. No, hold on. I am in media, media, right? I am in media. I know what we do, right? I know what we do. I know what in. Let me give you a very vivid example. When we launched Nigerian Campus Award in 2015, we practically begged people to come and sit down for that award. To sit down, like, for the award to hold. A couple of guys got tickets to come for the award. We were practically telling the other guys, okay, don't worry, just enter, enter, sit down, sit down. We, because we had decided at that point that, you know, this thing is going down, but we have to make the best out of it. We did it and everything. And... 90 days, like three months down the line, they're getting calls like, guys, are you the organizers of Nigerian campus? I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, um, are you guys still? Say, yeah, it's going to happen. By the time 
we announced nomination for 2016. We could not control the numbers. <laughs> we lost con. I'm not joking, right? Se we practically conv we were able to convince seven campuses to participate in the first award in 2015. By 2016, 18 without asking, 18 campuses participated. The nominations opened on the first of April this year. By the fifth day, we have gotten over 200 nominations over and above what we got for a whole three months period in 2015 by the fifth day now what did we do by the time 2015 ended we collected the pictures we lost some of the videos and everything we collected the pictures we spread it across all the existing blogs that we know so once we go on youtube and type nigeria campus award about five of it appears on the front page and then by the end of the award, we did a media tour of about six radio stations talking about what, how the award went well at launch. So people heard it on radio, went online and saw it on through Google and everything. By the time 2016 was ready, we're now trying to control the crowd that were coming in for. We had to. We spent about three nights screening people. For two, because we have a policy that each category is not beyond four, so you have to look for a lot of excuse to screen people and everything. So, what we do today, like he said, you are growing a local business. This is a local business. This is owned by one of us, whether we agree or not. It's a startup. It's growing and everything. It's owned by one of us. So, if we continue meeting like this once every month here, you are adding value to this business. Truly. Invariably, now the universe will see that and would not let a loop happen to you. So, by the time you are heading towards that December, January, or so, when you want to have the big conference, the hotel comes in. Plus, the fact that this hall, as it is now, can, this take can actually sit 40 people. people. Yeah, true. So, true. there's a lot we can do here in the next two to three months. And then, business meetings, and then uh, a lot of things will come out from small places. Removing the chairs, put this one here, the ones outside, put them here. I actually am not a fan of doing an event of 500 people. I actually want 30 people event. I actually want 40 people. So we can, I can meet Peter. Well, imagine yeah. if we were like 100 here. Yeah, I may not be able to meet that guy after now at all. So the effect is more the, the bond. Everybody goes on feeling like, hey, I was able to connect with this guy and I feel very happy. Oh, yeah, right? yes, I like right. this guy. <laughs> well, another thing you should also keep in mind is. You see, your, 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 I, I see everyone here individually as a leader. Yeah, yeah. You understand? So, another thing you should also keep in mind is you are going to be reaching out to not only 30 people. So, you now you have to start projecting, you now have to start thinking big, thinking huge. You understand? You cannot subject yourself to uh, only 30 people, only 40 people. We're not trying to say No, I understand. I, I, I understand. Well, I understand. The effect of meeting 30 people is strong. It is. You won't believe it. We can we can we can if we can make here even a permanent place for certain people. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? We can grow mm -hmm. our leadership days to maybe like fifty and we know that we are now the only leaders meet at a particular place. Even if you understand there, even if we you get the other outside like a master class, that if you say okay, we do a conference X way and you want to talk about what you talk about you say i want to talk to 20 people this is going to be the place and 20 people pay to even if the event is free 20 people want to like people say um, information is free on google knowledge when it's arranged together and put in the phone we can say you can have a, a, a an ebook an audio course a training and you want to do it and you don't want to go and spend that much time resources doing it this is this is that place so even if we're going to pivot, as in they should have one big, like something where you know this is home, mm -hmm. they can always come back to that place. Yeah, that's and honestly, the same thing. honestly yeah. these guys are very welcoming. Please,